Hey everyone, how you doing? Well, uh, I went shopping yesterday and uh, spent some time. I had stopped at about six to eight different stores and uh, found some nice little items for my giveaway. So uh, this is kind of an update on uh, my subscriber appreciation giveaway. Um, do you know? I'm hoping to see some VRs, guys. Make sure you post them on that video as a VR. Otherwise, I will miss them and the uh, judges won't get to see them. So uh, I'm going to give you a quick run through of all the prizes and uh, I'm going to try and make this video less than 10 minutes or 15 minutes. So, all right guys, here we go. Well, first, we got this cool little bag. Um, now this will make a great bag for, uh, you know, your personal hygiene, toothbrushes, brush, comb, uh, stuff like that, or, you know, a mess kit, silverware, um, spices, stuff like that. So, got that. We've got a uh, nice microfiber towel here. Um, these are really nice, guys. Um, so, oh, hold on, 100 feet of paracord, that's uh, OD green, um, two of my Blue Hill UL stoves, um, I'll get another can for this one, um, so there's two of them, what else we got, we got some goop, some good stuff guys, you can repair almost anything with this stuff, uh, what do we got here, uh, utility knife, um, brand new. These are nice to have and if you've got a strop or a leather belt you can keep the blade nice and sharp so you don't have to carry a ton of blades with you. Uh, what else we got? We got some jute twine. We got some uh, triple antibiotic ointment. Um, I like this better than um, Neosporin. Um, it's the same product it's just a different price. Uh, Hydrocortison. Good stuff to have. Um, Let's see here. We got a little bit of fishing stuff here. We got a couple, uh, couple of these one-inch bobbers, um, an assortment of hooks, and some uh, Berkeley Trilene um, eight-pound line. It's not the most expensive stuff in the world, but uh, it works pretty good. I run this on some of my fishing poles, so, and it's great for uh, you know like ultralight fishing. Um, well, not ultralight, but light, ultralight to light. Um, you should be able to catch some uh, nice fish on this. Uh, what else we got? We got some uh, medical tape, waterproof. Uh, let's see here. Let's get down in here. A travel toothbrush. We've got a Coglin's uh, 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 ferro rod. Now, this is what I use, guys. Um, I've ordered other ones online, different name brands. I won't mention them, but these work just as well. Um, and they're cheaper, you know, they're like five bucks a pop, so let's see here, what else we got? We got a pill fob, so if you need to carry something, keep it dry, those come in really handy. Uh, we got some uh, drink mixes, hold on here, we got some lemonade, some cherry pomegranate, some peach tea, some of those, uh, it's here, gotta have some flarp. <laughs> Uh, I found these bottles yesterday. Now, these make great um, uh, bottles for your mess kit. Like, if you want to bring some oil with you, uh, vegetable oil, olive oil, sesame oil, something of the sort, um, they're awesome. Um, I have a couple of these in my mess kit, or, well, something similar. So I bought, I've seen these, and I had to have them for you guys. A um, little roll of duct tape, got to have that. Uh, some electrical tape, got to have that. And here's some uh, cloth tape. Um, this is what they use, like, on a, well, what hockey players use on on hockey sticks. Um, it's great. Um, it's really strong, guys. Um, you wrap it. Um, it's pretty hard to uh, tear. You you pretty much need a knife. So if you need to repair something, this is a good way to do it. What else we got? Well, we got a couple of these stick bobbers. And I like these because um, if you set your bait up right, these bobbers will lay flat in the water. Um, and when you get a bite, they go like this. And when they hit it hard, they go pook. Um, so you catch a lot more fish with this style bobber because you can tell what the fish is doing. Um, if you put a heavier weight on it, they sit like this, and it acts just like a normal bobber. So it's really up to you guys. Uh, what else we got? We got some uh, some um, lip balm, hydrating lip balm. Um, I like this stuff. It works pretty good. Yeah, let's see here. Got some super glue. Got these uh, a little flashlight. Um, this is what I carry my little fishing um, kit in my ribs pack. Uh, my son has them. I have them. Um, not bad for a uh, um, single AAA battery. Uh, let's see here. We got uh, five lumens, six hours, with a beam of uh, 
13 meters or 42 feet. So, um, not an expensive flashlight, but a good flashlight. All right, see what else we got. Little composition book. Um, everybody's got to have one of these. A little uh, cap bomb. These things are fun to play with. Put a cap on the end and then uh, <laughs> throw it in the air. Let her come down. Bang! Uh, let's see here. We got some uh, some wet wipes. Get all those out of there. Wet wipes or wet ones. Antibacterial. We got some gauze. Two by two gauze packages. Uh, we've got some alcohol prep pads, a few of those. Um, we've got these little bug patches. Now there's uh, six in each one. So you've got a total of 12 of these little patches. And they do seem to work all right. Um, so let me know what you guys think of these because there are mixed reviews on this, but um, I do like them. So uh, let's see here, what else? Marker, everybody's got to have a marker. And this is a Comlin which is, uh, I think is better than Sharpie. Um, the tips seem to last longer on these. I use these in my shop area. Um, I've had some for two, three years, guys. So, yeah, they're nice. Uh, what else we got? We got some uh, picture hanging wire. Well, 25 foot of utility wire. Good useful item for repairs. Um, you could even make a survival fishing hook out of this if you rigged it up right. So, let's see here. What else we got? Ooh, we got a little uh, uh, magnifying glass here. Now, it's not a Fresno lens. Um, this is two times magnification on this side. And this little dome over here is four times magnification. That's why I got it, um, because if you're trying to start a fire using a magnifying glass, it's better to have more magnification than, than less. All right, what else we got? Uh, some scouring pads for your mess kit. We've got uh, some sponges. These will come in handy for you guys. They're thin, lightweight. Uh, we've got some uh, antibacterial uh, wipes. And these uh, reusable wipes, these are nice too um, for bathing or, or towels for drying your, um, your mess kit with after you wash them. Uh, we've got some uh, two bandanas, uh, camo and uh, olive drab. And some more antibacterial travel pack wipes. Um, a couple of these little uh, soap containers. And then uh, inside I stuffed. Let me open that up. We get some uh, carabiners. Carabiners. Uh, some Velcro. Uh, some more Velcro in there. And then some uh, waterproof matches. Uh, let's see, let's go to this one. And then here we've got uh, this little keychain uh, bottle opener with a Phillips and a flat screwdriver on it. Um, I used to carry one of these a lot when I was in maintenance because there were a lot of things I could fix with just this and I didn't have to carry my tool belt. So these are really handy. And honestly, I, I don't like carrying a, uh, a multi tube because they're just heavy and I don't wear a belt all the time. So things like this kind of come in handy. Um, what else we got? We got some of these uh, binder clips. These come in really handy. Uh, let's see here. Oh, and we got a couple uh, P38 can openers for you. Now there'll probably be some other some other stuff stuffed in here as well as time goes on. Um, contest is going to run for about another week, maybe two weeks, and um, um, I'm going to have to uh, talk with the judges and uh, see how they're doing on this. So. All right, guys, I beat the 10-minute uh, mark, which is good, and uh, I just don't want to bore you guys, so we will uh, talk to you later. Bye-bye.